Yeah. Uh, welcome to um, Red up, yeah. TV Red Hot Topics. Oh, yeah, we are here. Just a little. Calm down. Let us yarn. Ay, ay, ay. How do you tell your partner your private things? Jeez. Hashtag <laughs> smelly fanny. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh <God. Yeah>. no. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I know a lot of what you want to talk about. You can stop, bro. Oh, yeah. Lord. Yeah, we, we don't we don't see Batty Pum Pum, you know. We just like <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've had a girl like with bad hygiene, but um I would say the pum pum is always clean. The pum pum clean, the pum pum get eaten. Like with the bad pumps, you know, like obviously, uh, I don't know, is it a tatter? Is it tatter? You know, get some Nivea or something. Nivea? Like bacterial vagina. Isn't is that clean. for like... I mean, I've not experienced the, you know, lady. Okay. Too. You know okay. you're not supposed to wash your bum or your with vagina fresh, or whatever, with, with anything then. but water. I, I mean, I knew this lady that I used to put cream in there. That oh makes my it Jesus. moist, like, you know. Why is it called moist bitch? Oh, that's one. No, no, like, it's like, you know, it's a, it's a cream from, you know. Like, but how do you tell your partner? And it helps clean. How do you even tell anyone their pussy smells? I think you just say they too it's should It's not just know, pussy like, now. Penis? It should be a bacterial infection. Oh, or penis something. smells. Ugh. Smelly no. penis. That's like. Have you seen a smelly penis? I haven't. No, no, I don't I know. I voice. swear, this thing says hashtag smelly fanny. Smelly fanny. We're talking in one direction, one direction right now. You're right. Actually. Let's go to that level. Yeah, I see. It's a funny is clearly for the girls from what I see. Fair um <laughs> bruh, she, Do you have a female partner? I think if she doesn't no, smell it. But then I'm just saying problem. if I was a guy and I was seeing somebody that had that, I'm trying to see the best way to say it without one hurting the person's feelings, two wrecking whatever it is that is going on because it's already oh. bad enough when somebody has, you know, smells funny or, I mean, look at uh, no leave, no transfer. She got disqualified because hey, that hey, she smells funny. She she I'm just saying, <laughs> she, she, <laughs> she said, you know, I feel like with guys, it's a bit easier because I feel for a guy, if he's going to smell funny, it's mostly maybe because there's hair and there's a lot of moisture but with a woman it's like the funny yeah it's how bad. do you what well, i think what, what you can do if it's not that bad you could just tell her like again you know so she's gonna get in the shower just wash up before right water, before right? right before you get in but she's not gonna get the eaten you know like no but know. what if she's just coming from the Obviously. shower and, just, it's, and it's still smelling ha, oh, so that that's happens. that's a problem Pray you out. know what say i would doctor. do <laughs> can i tell you what i would do i would tell her how Directly, listen. <laughs> just yeah. that, oh, your no, friend is obviously it's not going to be. Wait, like if, that. if 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 is is <laughs> this your girl or like a hit hey, and run? Yeah. You know, yeah. I don't your care partner. who it is. Fair. You just tell her because if I don't tell her, I'm the one that suffers. But a lady told me though, you know, if women like engage in eating like pineapples, like their juices actually taste like pineapple. <laughs> well, to be honest, yeah. in response to that, you are what you eat. Okay, so if you eat if you eat pineapples, if you eat fruits, take cucumbers, you smell fresh down there. Well, well, they say if you eat pineapples, your vagina starts to taste like it. I don't know if it's true. I think it's a myth. However, okay, let me give you a high life hack. If you eat cucumbers a lot, your vagina will definitely smell like cucumbers. However, there are different kinds of smells, right? Exactly. Yeah, so if it's that fishy one, maybe girl, go to the hospital, okay? You have bacterial vaginosis. Don't be walking around yeah. with bacteria up and down. But thinking <laughs> up the whole place. Thinking <laughs> <laughs> up the whole place. No, 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 no. First, of all, first of all, if you're smelling anything, you're having oral sex. I fucking hate oral sex. Oh, I think okay, it's a Farouk. waste of time. Oh. Anybody giving me oral sex, I'm giving somebody oral sex. I I'm feel just like, attacked. okay, so you don't like foreplay. Farouk, 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 come to the brighter side. You are missing out on life. Life is for the living. You are living dead. <laughs> I have no beef for oral sex. It's just not for me. It's just, I don't, I don't get why people love it so much. Like, it's a fucking waste of time. Get to the point. Let's fuck. That's it. Because, you know, it's like starting a car without, you know, using a key. It's a push start, yeah? But when you push the car, you jump in and you roll in, it's like Flintstones. It doesn't make sense. You need to foreplay, at least touch, kiss, caress. So I think she's not, you know, it's, it's relative. If your vagina is smelling, yeah. <laughs> 
you are just not doing a good job in the shower. No, some people have yeah. infections. Okay, let us not go to those. Those are extreme cases. Let us not talk about. Not particularly. No. no. Sorry, half of the fishy smells that like, is, is like come maybe up from, from the vagina. It's a bacterial it's vagina, infection. Vagina it's, yeah, 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 because two different things. There was here. a guy that you know he was with this girl. Say, oh, her pussy was smelling, but it was like she was coming. There was a lot of cream. And then, you know, the doctor was like, bro, that was trash, man. You know, it's not Yeah, like, but, but trash doesn't make your pussy smell, actually. It doesn't. No, it doesn't. Well, it doesn't maybe she had some she had, STIs, yeah, she had other, other things, things that were like, okay. okay. But what of when a guy's dick smells? That's the one I actually I think that's from just not bacteria. You're just dirty. Then no. Maybe just <laughs> no, not dirty. No, no, in my opinion, no, 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 like, Maybe he's not cleaned opinion. up. He's had some other, like, dirty fannies. Oh, and then he's left the condiments on there. They're just dirty because most of them are just going to urinate. You know, I said they wipe it when they're done. No, they do the shit. There's at least one drop. Yeah, yeah, there's at least one drop. On the honest truth is that you will be able to since Harry K wants to speak. It's like this. That's what you know about Harry. Then you think we need to change your boxers. Who told you that me and Allah were doing something? You know Allah has already come naked. Please, please. Um, so it's um, it's creative. It's um. I'm gonna let you, you know, create and uh, decide what it is. But I've got like shackles on my waist and a padlock. And, um, and I'm naked, halfly. Uh, this was inspired by Tokyo Makinwa. I saw that on our Instagram post. I don't know what Odie is on about though. There is absolutely nothing between Ola and I. Like, I'm as confused as you are, guys. Like, don't get it twisted. It's a twisted. Twisted. This is. I don't know. Maybe there's something wrong with Odi. We should get him checked. I think so. When they know, I will know more. I'm watching. I will, you will know when I know. Trust me. I don't hold anything back. I tell you as it is. Facts. <laughs> let, me move, let me just <laughs> bring this table, right? I think half of the guys nasty smells that come from women's vag women's vaginas, right? Come from guys. Dirty. Come from guys. Yes. Yes. Because. I mean, I'm not the doctor, but I went for cervical cancer screening and he said something about uh, there's this thing that the moment you have intercourse, it goes into the woman's part and boom, sha, 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 show up with cervical cancer. I don't know. That's not what he told me exactly, but I remember him saying something about men being the cause of something. So yeah, you know, and Coco said she had one knit girl that and then boom. Infection. Yeah, everybody's looking for somebody to blame. Truth be told, I'm telling you facts. Go and sort your shit out. Go and sort your fucking shit out. Um, I think men sometimes are to blame, but in the end, it's the woman whose hygiene and health that it is. So as women, just take care of your fanny. Don't blame it on anybody. So I don't think men are responsible for all women's smelly parts. But there are some women that are clean, they have they don't have bacterial vaginosis, and they will go and meet one guy with poverty penis that is smelling. And he will enter inside. Once he enters inside, your pussy is stinking up the whole place. So clearly he's moving around with a consortium of bacteria, just spreading it everywhere. Like a savage mongrel. Thank you. Case closed. Yeah. But I'm not saying that that's why your vagina will be smelling. I'm not saying that that is <laughs> no, because obviously. of this um, thing. See, this thing. That's also however, a factor however, to however consider. you guys are quick to talk about um Motutamo. <laughs> 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 you guys Hola. are going to talk about um, you, you know, smelly vagina, nye, 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 nye. guys. See. Do you know that? Top, I will just get clean, clean your smell, funny so. part. Do you know? Oh, Hygiene is important. Like clean clean your you know, funny part. The end of your kidney. Mm -hmm. Do you so perceive it? <laughs> well, your kidney is like lollipop. You have to know. Your mouth should be smelling when you're sucking a lollipop. Use cotton bud. Use it to check it. No one's happening, Daddy. I swear. Oh, like, you know, uh, they only think about their dicks when it's time to okay, go. It's something we different. Agree with you. We agree with all of you. Um, that, I don't know how well that would play, but I feel like in some situations it's advisable. Just, you know, get a whiff of yourself, know what we have to deal with. And if you are a smellow, you know, you can tell yourself the truth in front of the mirror. I mean, I don't know. I recall said a whole lot of things that I didn't understand, but I cannot lie to you. But. Yes, I know. So I don't know where I can. I don't, I don't know. I, 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 I didn't really agree with anything that she said. Let me just be factual with you. So I was okay. going to say, personally, if the roles were reversed, 
or and I had to tell my partner that the guy, the, the guy. Hmm. First thing first that is, is many. first thing first is for like two weeks. I no go near my man. No go near that side so that. He initiates the conversation. With your no. mouth, but with your vagina, like spread open for that. Stuff. There's a condom, love. I don't need to smell it. You use the condom. Mm. Sorry, do, you, do you get me? What if the so balls for are two weeks, why are you wearing the balls? If it's a girl, shall I? If a condom, I'm saying, I'm saying trickle. for me, like, because no the room might need fumigation after. No oral for two weeks. <laughs> and then when he now brings up the conversation of, oh, babe, what's up? We are not doing that. It's like, um, Here's the thing, love. Oh. Under the duvet again. You the buzz. Can I tell you? Can I tell you? <laughs> this is you guys actually. You know, wait, 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 I'm that sorry. That can break though. a relationship oh, fast. For me. It can. Yeah. You know how people say, um, if your best friend has body odor, would you tell them? Would you not tell them? I'll tell them. I used to be definitely. like, oh, I'll tell them, I'll tell them. No, let no, me tell you. When I, I got there. Tell. No, like it was my I best friend, but she was shot close to me. I'm sure you lost her. I couldn't tell her because, I mean, you have to watch how people would react to these things. Like, she was someone that was very insecure pull your hair. Yeah. and mm-hmm. whatever it was. So, I, and the girls, ugh, I'm not very. But if if, if we're to be friend, my male friend, if we're to be my male friend, I probably tell. But the girl, I just have to girls, away. No, girls, honestly, take girls take it. Girls take it. Different different that's their yeah. business. So, as long as you know your intention. I mean, first of all, knowing business. that my partner is obviously a guy, obviously. <laughs> Yes, I need, to, I need to let them know. Reiterate. Well, exactly. <laughs> ah, it's gonna be hard because once you are even out of just normal smelling, go I can't take it. Okay. And I don't say the pen is smelly. Mm. I think I'll write later. Conversations like that, I don't know how. I, I don't I, uh, see I hate awkward conversations I don't care with the in my life. I don't care with the so how do I say babe? Uh, you stink. So no, what, what did if he puts? Did he wait? We need to ask this question. Did he start smelling from when we started dating? Or hey, oh, oh, all of a sudden, <laughs> maybe his village people started following him. Then all of a sudden, he not started. No, because okay, to answer the wait. question. Well, guys, yes, a letter, but not like postal letter, like address. I'll just write a note. Baby, we need to talk. It's about the penis. Oh no. I'm not the type to give a fuck. I will tell you how it is. If you take it the wrong way, that's your fucking business. I will tell you, your shit stinks. Babe, can we? Uh, this letter, I'll just put dot, 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 dot. I don't know what to say. Because I don't like to have those kind of conversations. For me, I'm very blunt. I'm very insensitive. Do you understand? I'm not going to sit down and be thinking, huh, let me come out to my baby. Hey, baby. So basically, this was happening. Nah, I don't got it. time for that. I probably won't even put thoughts into it. When it's time to fuck, it's like, yo, I'm not going to do this. Ah, why? You think stinks. Ah, it's smelling. Okay. Nah, sh- you know, can I shower? Can I see? Can I see? It's smelling. Okay, I'm sorry. It's smelling. Can I, can I come in? Please? Yeah. What is wrong with a good old fashioned conversation? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's what, what I said. What's wrong with that? Because oh, I would do it this way. Mm-hmm. If I don't like the smell or if I don't like anything, mm-hmm. I'm not willing to give you a chance to do your thing. I will tell you what I don't like. Mm-hmm. Fair. Mm-hmm. And then I hope if you decide to tell me, oh, go, then I have to go. But I would just really tell you. The tell you go no, no, I can't tell you to go. She yeah. will wash the <laughs> vagina. No, she may say, <laughs> she, must she doesn't like you. She will package it for you. You know how people are. People are like, you know, they don't like they're defensive. Yeah. 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 You tell someone something. Some people don't like her. Yeah, that's the thing. So I will tell you. No, However, if she really cares decide. about you, she would have to, you know, because Work obviously I'm it. sure she wants that good deal. Well, you guys so she has to like sorry. repackage for Or maybe I will tell my partner, babe, let's go out. Then I will now stop by the hospital. <laughs> yeah, let him smell some <laughs> you guys have to understand that for women and men, it's different. I think honestly, men are I not, I think men are not. So if you just tell your boyfriend, babe, I think oh, your balls, I might even say, oh, sweaty balls. I don't know. No matter how you take it, that's your fucking And it's surely because for guys, it's surely because for guys, it doesn't mean, I don't think it means you have an infection. Yeah. For girls, it's different. There are different kinds of smells there's a fishy smell there's a musky oh, smell there's like oh how no, do you know what to you know, do see, I'm, I'm a girl i went to an girl second I, I, I think i think i think sorry i think nah, girls who, you see i think girls should wax i think girls should take i think girls should take a hundred two i like saying something i really think girls should take their vagina seriously very you know that ajay that spot you know it's like it's a it's a portal so the portal is like a local slang term when you say the portal obviously that's like the cooking pot the main place because you know life comes from there and um it's a pleasure center as well um 
So I think it's very important it's taken care of because the character around the person, the intellectual capacity, all that is good. But the moment the hygiene doesn't, you know, collaborate with those things, then it puts a very big ditch in the relationship. So that's like a pothole. Fucking hell. I've said this before and I'll say it again. I fucking love our lads of pieces. But that nigga's crazy. The shit he comes out with, like, I'm like, dude, bro, what the fuck are you talking about? I think we all know that Ola is not really okay upstairs. So we, all of us, we just, we all used to allow him because we know that he's not okay. Seriously, to that pothole, it's it's a it's a lot, you know, because it's a goddess. Seriously, no, seriously. Oh, you always say the crazy I love you, but you said so. That fanny pack needs to be secured, you know. That bag needs to be secured. Needs to be cleaned. Needs to be well packaged. You know, take care of. So wax regularly. Why? Because if the guy is not eating it, obviously it's it's kept on clean. That's why. And obviously he's not. No, there's some people that just don't enjoy it. They also eat dirty pussy. You say no. no, no. It's, no, it's, no, it's, no my thing is this. My thing is this. I don't care how clean you are. There's always a scent. No, there's no a scent. That's what. bodily scent. I think that's fine. Like people understand that because, like me, I'm a personal trainer. You see, so obviously, we're, even with training, my ex when she pulls out my dick, she's like, "Oh wow, it doesn't smell." You know, like I could finish training and she's like, "Okay, okay, okay." okay. So, you like, tell your partner, sorry, so like, 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 <laughs> tell your partner, and it doesn't improve. <laughs> is this a deterrence? Like, are you gonna keep it moving? Like, you know what? Take your smelly pussy away from my. Honestly, life. no, no, no. <laughs> If she, if she washes it and, it's, and it, still, doesn't it doesn't get better, then you try the doctor stuff together. You can even I like just, have a see. Shrink. I don't care. Oh, I don't care how really you nice. guys see this, but there are just certain things that are literally you, my like, deal can't. breakers. Yeah. yeah. So you, that's why I feel like even having a conversation. Wow, because you know by the time you have that conversation, it's like it puts you, you know, you don't know like no lips and thing, yeah, and you know it's not gonna like you, you can't have a foreplay with that that sort of thing. And um, without a foreplay, you know, you can't arouse her to get into a climax on time, um, the orgasm or, you know, the um, other situations. But I think, you know, if her mouth smells good, like she's got good hygiene, then you can even have a conversation like, oh, go take a shower so you can have her like, you know, make sure her pum pum is, you know, smelling the same way, like clean to her. Uh, if, you know. Shut up, my friend. Will you <laughs> no, if, the, if the mouth odor is bad, wait. It's, it's bad. Mouth, it's anything odor, mouth, body, no, penis, the, whatever. The vagina can I, be body those sense. kind of things, like I don't actually joke with them. People think it's okay. I don't think it's compulsive disorder, but I just don't like it when it's things are like case. nah, well, guys. I, so I, I would rather really not have a conversation. I would rather not just do anything. I'll just. You're gonna walk, walk away because mm -hmm. I mean, having the conversation like, in the first place is very yeah. difficult for me. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm saying this in all honesty, like, I'm not gonna try to fake or say, okay, because I don't want people to see me a certain way. The honest truth is, your penis is smelling, it is a huge turn off for me. I'm sorry, so you wouldn't I would probably would write a note because I don't like to have certain awkward conversations, mm -hmm. or maybe I'll buy you baby wipes so that when you finish, we will you'll be clean, <laughs> smoke, smoke, yeah, but, 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 but this, after that, and it keeps smelling. I'm done, bruh. Like, but I'm gone. Here's my thing. Why would you guys ever put yourself in a situation where you can smell something funny and turn you off? Just fucking go for the penetrative sex. Hey. Why do you... Yes. Farouk, if not smells dick or vagina that smells it when they have not opened the leg. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Coco, oh, that is why. Coco, you mean three That lot. is why. <laughs> 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 I'm you so don't sorry. know somebody that you will just say, oh my God, I just want to, babes, do you want to close your legs a bit? Thank you. Oh, thank you. God bless. But what? to be fair, to be fair, the only time, the only time when I fuck somebody is when I'm really drunk. So okay. at the same time, okay. the sense the, of the, smell, the sense of smell is, is, is a yes, bit off. I've been in, Farouk, my last relationship was a while sense. back, so I don't even remember. You know, it's not really clear. It's not no. your... No. Like, no. No. That's, no. Why. That's why, that's why. That's why. That's why. I will not lie, I've smelled a whole lot of shit. You're a monster, bro. But at the end of the day, <laughs> I like because, that. Too. Because I know what people are like. I always like to go back to the start that it is. First of all, start with hygiene. Take care of yourself. Exactly. Have a good shower. Yeah. If that is not the problem. Right. Let me tell you, a lot of you people like to hide behind the fact that it may be this guy, maybe that guy. The truth of the matter is you don't know how to bath. Yes. Those what you Oh, do you nailed it on the head there? You don't know how to bath. Because, because you remember the last thighs, conversation. You know? I'm a very clean guy. Oh. Don't come here with, with your, with your, with your, with your you know, another thing And that's smelly funny. <laughs> Probably then not all dick. Smelly funny, all smelly dick. And then the rate at which you wear pants it's to bed is key as well. It's, 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 it
<laughs> no, but you know that, you know that it's natural. Like it's natural to have two showers in a day. Uh, <laughs> so for those of no, you, no, let's not start that conversation. For those of you that have two showers in a day, earlier today, then it's possible that your thing may be smelling. Because oh, that, that, see, 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 this normal. thing, you talk about this thing on Twitter this morning, saying that, um, some sort of thing, if you are not having your bath twice a day, you are dirty. Or God, it depends on what you are doing during the day. Fair if enough. I have my bath in the morning, I'm on bed all day. Does that mean that I'm dirty and I need to bath in the night? Baba, do whatever you want to well, do. Or do you say okay. you don't need to bath in the night, but you need to wash your vagina? Okay. In the night, do you whatever you want to do. Clean, clean, clean. I wash your penis too. Nobody, yeah, your nobody, penis nobody, too. nobody is telling you to have a shower twice a day. But I can guarantee you that if you have a shower twice a day, you will not have the issues of this smell. No, but then, may be going to. I think I'm not um, somebody who is like, oh, if you don't shower twice, you're dirty. Because like Arika said, sometimes you shower in the morning or midday and you don't sweat, you don't go out. But what I would advise is even when you don't shower, like my mother would say, tamba, just get water, clean yourself up there and go to sleep. At the end of the day, my own bathing is my shower gel, my soap, you got to get that scrubby in. You know, put in some effort. You got to try. Morning. And this is for me. Whatever you guys want to do is your business. This is what I do. Morning. And that's maybe because I go to the gym more. So after I come back from the gym, I have to shower. So morning and evening. Which I'm lucky for showering twice. And I can see um, my skin is looking good, man. Trust. You can see now. Um, I actually like my shit natural. Why you say natural? Oh, because natural, somebody can have it. Like the hair, yeah. I like natural. <laughs> so what hair, God man. gave you, whatever you're growing, just great. But what is the hair? Do you know what is going on here? <laughs> <laughs> we don't even want to know. How old are you? Well, well, you're going to be born in 28. You'll be growing hair for 28 years. Bro, <laughs> Baba, that, that friction is crazy, you know. You know that some hair that is like sponge, that metal sponge. So. <laughs> I like that so natural. Hey, I hope you're growing a forest. Natural, bro. No, but at the same time, my peeps, my peeps found that my peeps. Say no more. I have peeps. Say no more. But your hair texture is nice, so it makes it nice. Like it's smooth. It's not too much. We're just talking about people that are not guys. Just in case you having good hair. It's smooth. It's not too much. It's nice. Just in case you having good hair. It's smooth. It's not too much. My my peeps are not too much. But I like the other person to know. It's smooth. It's not too much. My my peeps are not too much. But I like the other person to know. It's smooth. It's not too much. My my peeps are not too much. But I like the other person to not to have to be natural but if it's so like if, if it's overbearing <laughs> then i'll be like oh but okay. that's nature it's but you can braid it it's nature it's nature but at the same time there's some people that it okay. just grows like Whoa. yeah yeah i'm like yo okay you this, this can't happen <laughs> just braid it okay so for me right i don't like to see any hair for me and for my partner the you guy. need it for two Bout stuff. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Karine, who is this girl? I don't like it. Apart from the fact that it doesn't even look nice, sucking dick, there's hair everywhere, it's choking you. Like, what the fuck is all this? Like, Listen. No, don't nobody have time for this. <laughs> However, and also, also, it breeds germs, heat. When The more hair, the more heat. No, sweats. but there are some people, when they shave, you'll be scratching them. Yeah, they have bumps and shit. So it's mm. better for them to have To it. wax, you can wax, you know. Uh, you know everybody this can is a struggle. I don't know, but I'd rather <laughs> see no hair. <laughs> okay. See no hair. Hair no hair. Hair no hair. First of all, first of all, first of all, I want to touch on what Farouk said. <laughs> oh my God. Oh. Yeah, because I've been doing my hair uh -huh. for four months. Oh my God. And it's this much. So it's so only, God, on. only God knows what's going on here. Fine. Wow. Okay, but um, at the end of the day, you know, you did say something. And... I like for people to do whatever it is that they want to do. That yeah, makes them feel most comfortable. But to be honest, zero everything. Okay. But I will not be truly upset if that's what you want. I'm not a person that likes to disturb uh, another person's person. Yeah. So you do whatever upset. you want to do. But I want you. zero, Sha. You so you bend and suck your dick by yourself then. Um, as darling, the, I'm not doing I don't that. mind it, but just as long as, like she said, I don't have to use toothpick after because I'm honey. <laughs> toothpick, why do you need a toothpick? Because you've never had hair that's so like, yeah, yeah, yeah. if it's yeah. there, good. But if you know that you are the type that used to grow, ringo, ringo, <laughs> those yeah. hairs that go uh, like this, ba -ba. honey, you know. so shave, okay? Let's just take care just, of Just put a fade, yeah. I don't yeah. need no rolls okay. up in my teeth, okay? I'm done with you. Most of my friends prefer smooth, but I don't know why. There's something about just being natural. It's like, damn, it's so much more sexy to me. I don't know, I don't know what it is. I've got a fucked up mind. Basically, ringo, ringo is... <laughs> You know, there's people that they have not I'm not being tribalist or nothing, but you know, all these evil men that have the you know they grow straight. It's just it's like spark spiral. It's like circle, circle. That's ringo ringo. That's at least that's what I call it. 
one is uncomfortable like it, it's <sighs> it's sharp it will be like choking you you know what i'm saying one two hair breeds like bacteria sweat heat is dirty i do not like hair you will never find hair on me to be honest there's nothing there let me just be honest with you <laughs> <laughs> All this hair that you see here doesn't exist down there. Let me just let you know that. Facts. <laughs> yeah, yeah cancel. <laughs> um, so for me, I think I'm actually indifferent. Okay. Um so do you what, know this team. No, yeah. I mean do what, <laughs> That's a good team. Freak of the day. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> do what you're comfortable with. Mm -hmm. However, please let it be clean. And me, I can why I'm very indifferent is because I don't engage in oral sex. I don't like it. Thank I feel you. it's disgusting. Thank you. But I'm not going to go into that conversation. I love it so disappointed. They speak for themselves, okay? They please, do not speak on Please speak for yourself. <laughs> yeah. I'm, right. I'm speaking for myself personally. I feel like. Because, I, like, boys, why you people urinate? It's not like you clean it or anything. They don't like, actually, like, 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 why you, do you, they you, not you urinate through that, <laughs> like, that axis. That's <laughs> your, where you are passing waste. Uh, I will not come and yeah. say that that's what I want to but enjoy. Wait, you know, it's so quick to insult babes that don't, <laughs> that don't <laughs> clean up when they can clean. They, can they chop your work, though? I don't ask for it. If you want to, okay. Oh. Uh, but I don't ask for it I, because I know that I, no, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. We eat all our genitals. So, we eat so, so, it. I mean, if, 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 I don't, if I don't, if I don't engage in oral sex and I can still perceive something, then problems you want. But uh, I mean, the friend, if you want to keep your hair, keep it, but let it be clean. If it's going to be shaved, keep it. Whatever, let it be clean. But don't think that I'm going to touch. My mouth is going to touch. It's not going to happen. Just hey. pass and go. Oh, wow. That's a big one. Um, <clears throat> I think it's, it's personal. Uh, maybe she's not, you know, found the right candidate to uh, interact with. Um, or good hygiene, because obviously it seems like they've been, um, you know, having experience with people with, um, you know, bad fanny hygiene and stuff, or, you know, personal hygiene with the penis and stuff. But um, I think if she finds the right guy, or, you know, if she's opportune to having me, you know, um, yeah, she might have a different take on that. Yeah, I do not like the idea of it. I feel like it's dirty. Um, be careful not to come for me because I will let you know what I feel because at the end of the day, it's my opinion. <clears throat> it's disgusting. Like men go to the bathroom. They don't exactly wash up, you know, or clean. Even if you use wipes, that means I'm going to be... It's just disgusting, guys. I eat from this mouth. I cannot come and be putting some of these waste products in my... It's come on. No, that's terrible for Ola. Because <laughs> I know Ola is trying to work on that. <laughs> and I know the kind of guy that he is. <laughs> it's a catastrophe. <laughs> but I mean, she's allowed to like what she likes and what she doesn't like. I mean, that's her business, man. I don't really give a shit. <laughs> oh my god, I'm sorry, I want to say something. Guys no, always forget to. there's one part of like they wash some some guys who wash the dick, right? They will not forget the balls. Under the balls. Under the balls. Like you have to wash under if you your use balls. Baby you, have to boys. you have to wash <laughs> under your balls. Boys and girls. <laughs> Boys hey. and girls, you have to scrub everything. Do you know that? Um, statistic, so, so, we should put this into statistics. <laughs> we should put this into statistics and bring everything out now. Oh yeah, no, let us see. So I'm, I'm going to deliver my who, point here. Okay, Allah, uh, Allah, Allah. So what I feel, you? right? Um, I feel like you know, um, you know, <laughs> my mom's an artist. You know, my dad's an architect. So I feel like I'm very creative. I would like the girl, like maybe she can make some shapes. Some I knew he was gonna say that. On the vagina, you know, <laughs> like, put just my name, you know. You, your name? Like oh, just hey. initials. <laughs> I, I like just a initials. So good shapes. I like, you know, different creativity, you know, like names. She could put her heart there. Um, my initials, C-O, can be O-O, -O, C O O O O C O C O. like any, you know, it could just be one of the letters or the initials. She could like dye it, green, white, green, or it could be, you know, my favorite color, you know, it could be white, it could be black. It's, it's really cool. Or she could have it bowed or bald, like just skin. I'm, I'm with it, but just make sure it's clean. The lips are open and all that is tidied up. <laughs> you know, it's like sort of like a role play. Just keep it, you know, the banter. Just keep the relationship. Keep the going. banter with her. Um, waxing is good, you know. Uh, hair too is good. I like the hair because I like the texture. Uh, I like to play with it sometimes. But obviously, you need to be experienced. You know, you need to like... You need to put your initials. Sorry, you like your telephone wire. Shave your initials. No OD. No no, 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 that was a good idea. You need to spread bro. open the hair. Obviously, the lips. She should spread it in the sun. You, you need to spread open, open the, the lips. lips. 
rinse, rinse, rinse. So obviously when you're, you know, licking or eating the clit or, you know, if you're saying washing as well, the hygiene, she needs to know to be able to do those things. Hola, hola. Hola. Yo. Hola, is your telling you. Know, it's it's biology. Yeah. Yeah. It's just biology. Yeah. 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 Can I say something? They don't spread open. Quickly. They don't wash the clitoris <laughs> and all this. Nigga, <laughs> I love you, bro, but you say the weirdest shit. <laughs> you, you don't have lips. a vagina, so yeah, you don't know. Yeah, so I'm not talking about dicks. Yeah. Yeah. You have to wash in between the lips. You have to wash in between the lips. Yeah. I mean, you know more about have cocks, you so you don't know. Have you taken care of any woman <laughs> before? Like an old elderly woman. Have you taken care of any woman before that you know that? Yeah, maybe an elderly woman. So, like, listen, like the first lady I dated, she showed me everything. Like, she spread open her legs, she showed me her henna. Bruh, you know, and I learned about the henna that. and you know <laughs> what, the vagina, <laughs> like, and she actually henna washes inside. it. Hi, man. And the <laughs> bottle, <laughs> henna, henna. What's henna? henna? <laughs> Look, yeah. henna, henna. henna. <laughs> There's henna in the vagina. <laughs> Where? Oh, hi, men, dear. Hi, men. Oh. Yeah, hi, men. That's why I said hi, men. I'm like, what? There's henna? Where? Yeah, yeah. I, I, it just makes that. You know, I was meant to get some henna like, on my abs and stuff, you know. Oh, my God. It's in the mix. Okay, so the henna thing, you know, my apologies. Um, I was trying to say henna, right? The the virginity, you know, the, the, the wall there. Um, I was That was brought to my attention when I was 18. Um, because a lady showed it to me and um, she explained all oh, this, the wall you break into before getting to the vagina walls. Right? So um, I feel it's, I made a mistake because obviously I was meant to get some tats, like, you know, like the rock on my chest and a little bit on the sides and the lateral, you can see my eight packs and stuff. But um, I, I, I couldn't put it there, but you know, so I just mixed the words, but you know, uh, I hope the ladies didn't take that offensive. But you know, she puts a henna on her henna around it. I still go with that. It's, it's a good look. Yeah. Well, okay. you know what I'm trying to say though. You, you need to know your lips and be able to like. <laughs> For the record, no. Clean your fanny pack well, well, girl. So all I'm just trying to say is, I don't have a vagina, but I've been introduced and showed by you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Girl, clean your ass. You got a nice big booty. Clean your ass. So you need to wipe your ass clean. Don't only use tissue. Make sure it's wet water. wipes. No, okay, so that's bad. That is wrong. All right, it's wrong. That it's is wrong. wrong. That is wrong. Don't use water. Water. Have a what? kettle. Water. You know, do your ablution with your cleaning. So uh, do you have maybe how which way to wipe? Or do you, do you know that far? Uh, I think don't you wipe down so you know, or up. But you know, you don't you're want the juices going to your asshole. I, I yeah, wouldn't backward. know how it works. You're supposed backward. to wipe backwards. Oh, they did not. Why wouldn't you show you that? No, no, I mean, I think it's best to just wash. You, you just, just wash. I, I don't you clean it or anything, you know. I just, I lick it, I eat it, you know. I'm open to both holes. I'm using, I'm fan fresh because it's I can't with this. Eat that booty like groceries, bro. Here's the thing with Olaye. Just don't take him seriously. And honey, H Y M E N and H E N N A. You know, you 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 have such a nice body. Let's attach, you know, some wit to it. It's it's a hymen, not henna. To the exact ex that taught Ola about the VJJ, he did not do a good job. First of all, it's not portal because I don't think that place is like a vehicle that is driving straight and he entered you. No, it's directed into it. Do you understand? I know it's a bit graphic, but Imagine it, and if you can try it, where you are, look okay. And then henna, henna is supposed to be something that we draw on our hand. I should get it the next time. Not, is it a hymen or something? Because me, I'm even worse with pronunciations, but I know it's not henna. And ah. the X, well done, Biogra no, I said biography teacher, <laughs> biology teacher. <laughs> See, Ola is just not normal. He's, the chain is supposed to use to hold his neck. He puts it on his waist. 